Guys, help! I've got a terrible Brentwood flow! <laughs> what the fuck is a Brentwood flow? You don't want to know, don't look! What is it? Avert your gaze! Can you find it on, like, WTF? It's disgusting down there! Can Jesus. I find it on WTF? Of course. Google Brentwood flow. What does it do? It'll be me. Is it a disorder? No, it's just some Because there was one horrible. here called a disorder. Pussy. Ugh, trot. It sounds like a river. Yeah. It's not quite liquidy, but at the same time. Oh. Just foul. The smell is the worst bit. Oh, trot, please. I'm just trying to masturbate. <laughs> Whilst He's trying to trials. get off. I don't know, it's <laughs> weird. So um, I'm coming up with a really cool problem where my controller instantly uh, disconnects and reconnects uh, quite intermittently, actually. Um, wow, shit, it might improve your times. might improve my times. So I might it might cut out the bits where you're shit. Well, that's it. And just yeah. knows. leave the bits that are good. But I don't know if that's... Mm, we'll see, we'll see. I'll, I'll give you results later, guys. Why later? I want to report right now. Because well, I need to test it out. I don't know. I guess so. Yeah, yeah definitely. Fuck. Oh! Oh my god, this is irritating. <laughs> ah! <laughs> you right? No, this controller's bollocks. This controller is bollocks. The, cable, the cable's what you're saying. The cable's being shit. Alright, I'm back in. But it's such a nice cable from there you go. Ank, or whatever it is. Don't fucking judge my cables, mate. Thank you. you judge my cables, I'm gonna judge your cable, if you know what I mean. But you just said it was crap. <laughs> yeah, no, it was. <laughs> it's, it's not ideal. I don't recommend it right now, but that's because I'm personally having issues with it. Don't buy their products. <laughs> <laughs> wow. I find they're pretty good. Yeah, no, they are, they are normally pretty good. Actually, saying that, my... Uh, well, did it fail recently? My iPhone one. Failed? Yeah, it doesn't work anymore. Yeah, no, I had an iPhone one that failed as well. So here we go. This is, this is a Charles all about failed products. Did you buy the, like, the one that's like... M MFI my, certified, yeah. MFI? Uh, yeah. My, isn't it? Oh, is it MFI? I think so. Okay. Yeah, well, sorry, it broke. Well, Listen, it's more that, like, right. you have to keep unplugging and replugging it in for it to then recognize that it exists. Oh. If Apple made better fucking cables themselves, we wouldn't have this problem. It'd be nice, wouldn't it? But their cables are so shit, they come apart I so easily. I feel like that's easily. a design oh, thing. Fucking trees. I feel like they do that on purpose so that you'd go back and buy that 20-pound cable. Another 30-quid fucking yeah. cable. Before you invested, like, 800 pounds on your phone, what more do you want from us, Apple? Well, they want that extra cash that they Bastards. clearly have a monopoly over. Cables! All those cables! Well, they don't really, because you can get them from anywhere, really. But they're shit, still. And expensive, for what they are. Fucking lightning cables. They're just shit, aren't they? They break so quickly. Super fast at breaking. Fucking hell. That depth of field. Go on, Smith, mate. You can do it. Oh, I cannot do it myself. Don't look at me. Don't look me in the eyes, that's please. It, that's it, that's it, lad. That's it, lad. That's it, lad. Come on, mate! Come on, mate! Oh, fuck. Yeah! Fuck this! I was so close. Oh, fuck. Oh, there's eyes. Time now. There's eyes. It's an end. Tea's gone cold, I'm oh. wondering why. Got out of bed at home. Money lane just in my window. Not copy, but all. You I'm feeling the next one. I'm gonna win the Disorder. next one. Disorder. You're not going to do shit, mate. No, I'm not going to do shit. Nothing's going to happen. No. Don't kid yourself. You're an embarrassment. Did you both watch the Doctor Strange trailer? I never watched yeah. it. Yeah. Is it good? It's fun. It looks really cool, actually. What, yeah. What, it, what, what, it looks so cool about Imagine it, huh? Inception. Sorry? Imagine, like, Inception right. meets fucking Doctor Marvel. Strange. <laughs> really? Yeah, well, it's got, like, because he's all about this, like, altering reality, reality and shit. So, like, it's very inception -y. Like, there's elements where the world Cities kind of has folding. multiple, yeah, folding elements and stuff like that. And it looks weird. And also, like, they, they hint at the fact that, like, there are multiple versions of him because it's based on the multiverse theory. Yeah. That anything that could happen does happen. Right. And they, they go from, like, there's a scene where he's in a car crash. Spoilers, by the way, if you if you can't even take the content of a the trailer. trailer, right? Uh, yeah, yeah. Um, it's not that spoilery, <laughs> but say, yeah. if, if yeah, people don't want to see anything like about anything, yeah. yeah. Um, so there's a scene where he's in a car crash, and it's like starts with him in a car crash, and they're like, and he's like going into surgery and shit. And then there's another scene where he's actually a doctor. So I'm guessing that is potentially no, another reality. No, no, it's not an origin story. What? So he no, has a car crash, incorrect. and he's a doctor. Yeah, he was okay. a very um, 
reputable um, surgeon. Surgeon, and his hands got broken. Ah, due to a car right. And that's so he couldn't happens. do that anymore. So he kind of lost the will. Oh, started traveling. And so he tries to explore him. Yeah. And he goes to like what looks like, I don't know, like, like a Buddhist temple style yeah, thing. Yeah, yeah, maybe Nepal or somewhere like that. I don't know the true origin. This is all from the trailer. Okay? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Jeez. So he goes to what looks like Nepal and he meets someone called the Old One, is it? The Great Old One? The yeah. Aged One. Who one. is played by. Um, oh, fuck, what's her Kurt name? Kurt Russell. It's weird. It's not Kurt oh, yeah. Russell. <laughs> it's. Um, uh, Mel Melinda. Oh, fuck it. She's the Ice Queen in Narnia. Oh, Tilda Swinton. Yeah, Tilda Swinton is now another equally sort of freakish, powerful woman. Um, Christ, Reddit goes nuts over that that actress. In what it's sense? Like, Any anything that has that person is fucking insanely awesome. Oh, okay. What are they talking about? Reddit. This? Oh, Reddit. Right, right. Sorry, I think. She was in a film where some guy was like, oh, I can't remember what it was called now. Fuck, it's gonna annoy me. But yeah, where her her kid was like, fucking like troubled. Right. And he ended up. Taking a, a fucking archery bow into school. Uh, it's not. Jesus. We need to talk about so and so, is it? <laughs> Sorry. It's not yeah, we need, we need to talk. About, yeah, about that's it. That is it. Actually, yeah. Is it, do we need to talk we about, Dan about or Adam? Somebody's name. J yeah. James. I don't know. Yeah. Can't remember, but yeah. Um, yeah. yeah, it's quite. That was one. It's it? actually an interesting film. Yeah. Um, but she's great in it, uh, and I think she's great in everything, especially Narnia, where you know, fuck, she's Narnia's the best film I've ever seen. Fucking sweets. I fucking hate the Narnia films. They're really? really shit, aren't they? Like, they just like obviously they came off, they came uh, out I prefer after the all the rings and stuff, and like it just looked so shitty. I know it wasn't supposed to be the same theme and stuff, but like fuck me. I mean, what you got to appreciate though is the money of source material is quite old. And, yeah, of like, course. Yeah. So it's all the rings. True. However, the style if you actually it's read style, the really. books, like the Narnia source material is very, like, uh, like wasn't it written in like the nineteen. Like midnight uh, 20th century, so like it's it's old, it sounds old, it sounds like it's written by you know a person who lived in an age where yeah, gender roles weren't really thought about. I think, um, C.S. Lewis, yeah, that was it. Um, when was Narnia? Narnia book, I might be a long wrong. time ago, uh, yeah. Day. So, the original Narnia series, The Will Lion, the Witch, and the Raw Drove, was written in 1950. Um, which isn't ages, wow, but you know, it's set in definitely a different time. Set in just pre war, isn't it? Uh, like just before the world, world War II kicks off. Well, the novels when, um, themselves. Yeah, yeah, when it's set. Yeah, because it's all about the. They get taken to yeah. countryside yeah. and then exactly, he finds yeah. a, a cupboard with someone because, else. Because, the wardrobe. Yeah. That's it. I know, so I, I, I know what you mean about that. I also think that, like, just really the target audience they were going for wasn't yeah. really us. No, you know? no, no. Oh, yeah, not at all. It's kind of very similar to Pan's Labyrinth in the sense that there's these people. Essentially, yeah, uh, you know, trying to find a fantasy away from the horrors of reality. Except Pan's Labyrinth was much sort of grown up, more grown up, wasn't it? And much yeah, it was more similar shocking. Concept, they tried to shock the audience a lot more in Pan's Labyrinth, I think. It's very cool, though. It's fucking awesome. I love Pan's Labyrinth. When I watched that film, I didn't know what I was getting into, and I was kind of like, "This is weird." And then, like, I need to watch. It. I still haven't fucking watched it. Oh man, it's pretty it's cool. cool. It to... might be a film of its time, though. I don't know. Yeah, I think Guillermo del Toro. It's a very unique style of cinematography where he likes practical effects, but they kind of look a bit weird sometimes. It, I watched um, I, I watched know. the scene with the the uh, blind man or whatever it's called, the man with the, the eyes hands, in his hands, yeah. and it still looks great. Yeah. It still looks really fucking weird and scary. I really like the. Would you like process. eyes on your hands? Um, I mean, if you had a choice, you could have eyes on your hands or your knees. Which one would you go for? Oh, my hands, hands obviously. easily. So much easier to point around. <laughs> Thing is, like, <laughs> holes in my you gotta think about the focal depth of your eyes. You can't really put your hands that close to things, otherwise, you wouldn't be able to see. Mm -hmm. Like, you know? I think that'd be the least of your troubles. Yeah, probably. You got eyes in your hands. You gotta pick, uh, up, you gotta pick <laughs> up shit. You gotta pick up shit with the eyeballs in the middle of your palm. Do you also what have you eyes in your face or not? What, no, you have toes on your where your eyes are. <laughs> what the oh, fuck? Yeah. That just seems that's so impractical. Why? Annoying. Why just would I evolve like, that? Why a toe? It's a sensory thing. You have to give me the evolutionary advantage of having eyes, uh, toes for eyes. Uh, basically, you can feel with them, and they're extra sensitive toes. We can just have nerve endings in the same place. Yeah, your toes. Why on earth would I want to feel with my eye sockets? Listen, all right, this is a fictional fucking scenario, right? You're gonna have toes for well, eyes. Eyes on eyes on your hands. You know, there's no. a potential there. That, that I criticise donators when they give us stupid questions, so I'm going to be fair and criticise your question That's as well. Mm -hmm. And I, I'm going to call it out and say it's stupid. Okay. And I will also want no, you to pay stupid. him, Smith. It's very stupid. Uh, no, Ross. I want you to pay Smith for having to ask that question. Yeah. 
I'm gonna pay you in the sum of fucking zero, you prick. I'll come in there and pay you with my fucking dick slap in your face! That doesn't sound like any type of payment. I don't think it's long don't enough to do any sort of slapping that takes gesture. That so. What? Huh? Pricking, then. Just prod. Prod, prod, prod. Can't get that fucking... Just really Ch slope. cause you've got a tuna can chode. Tuna can chode. Don't take that from... D&D. What is it? Yeah. Not taking things from my environment, mate. <laughs> What's a tuna can chode? A tuna can chode. A man with a dick that's so wide like and short tuna that can. it looks like a tuna can. Oh, shit, yeah. That's pretty <laughs> horrible. Tuna can chode! You use it as a punch weapon. Good thing is that's the easy peel cans. Oh, no drip. No drip. Or no drain, <laughs> whatever it is. No. Uh, none of us are making this fucking jump. No, it's weird. Jeez. It? It's weird that I haven't done it yet. Trot. Just do it already. Focusing on okay. tuna can chodes. If you had a tuna can chode, do you think it would be a gift or a curse? Curse? <laughs> well, why? What a stupid fucking Well, curse. no, what if it's like... It's impractical. But it feels like everything. ten times better. Well, you can't just ra can't add a random modifier to the question. Ten times better. But you're also a millionaire. Um, but no, yeah, yeah, and you'll also I live have forever. to add a modifier to you'll make live... it seem like, well, well is no, it worthwhile? Because no. that doesn't count. Is it worthwhile? Think about the full question before you say it. Is it worthwhile if it, if it felt ten times better, but it was a tuna no, can chode? No, the use of it, I'd have to find ways of using it. It's Imagine, like, the buzzer on a, on a game show. Yeah. That's what it, that's what it looks like. That's exactly what it looks like. It looks like a red, big red buzzer on a game but show. It also has John <laughs> West etched on the side. Yeah. I can't use it, Ross. <laughs> Why did you tattoo all this tuna art on your side? <laughs> John your West. <laughs> you got a full John West label on there. <laughs> Fucking hell. Tuna can chode. Oh, you've even got the calorie information. Oh, yeah. a lot of calories. Yeah. Nutrition. Oh, it's nutritious. Right, well, we have. Oh, in brine. <laughs> this uh, one's in brine, not sunflower oil. Ooh. I don't like uh, sunflower oil. No? No, I need Or dry. spring water. I prefer brine. I prefer brine as well, but I also prefer brine on my cereal. Is that weird? <laughs> yeah, just the brine. That's just the brine. Yeah. yeah. Brine no, on great. my cornflakes. Thank you very much. Cornflakes and brine, please. Yeah. Sorry? Yeah, that's right. Brine. Brine. <sighs> God, that was so fucking rancid. That would be horrible. Brine stinks. What cornflakes in brine? Yeah. Yeah. No, well, yeah. Well, I pour brine over my cornflakes. My great aunt once used to have no. Weetabix with hot water. That's oh. weird. Really? And like, she wouldn't have milk, so she'd just have hot water on a Weetabix. Why hot water? That's it, because it was Softened like, it? I guess she might have been lactose intolerant or something. Maybe. But like, it was just so with gross. Hot, it it just created like hot mush, hot, hot wheaty mess. mush. Hot, sticky mess. Oh, fuck. Yeah, well, not that sticky, but I have a floaty boat. Weirdo. Right, finished. That was a that was a quick. That was meant to be a hard, apparently. Really? These are all hards, apparently. It's bullshit. That one, that one felt that's incredibly easy. <laughs> Even Ross finished it. Yeah, that's Even that's Ross something. finished it. To be honest, it. that's saying something. Because holy sh <laughs> shit! Say it. Say it like you mean it. <laughs> shit! Yeah! Yeah! Tony Yayo is my favorite musician. I love Tony Yayo. Belly flop. Which do you prefer, even... Tony Yayo or the Ying Yang Twins? I, I <laughs> it's got to be the Ying Yang Twins. Has it? Yeah. Nice. Tokyo Drift, mate. Ah, right, yeah. Dun, 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 dun. That shit song. I mean, it's, it was dreadful, but hilarious. Fucking great. Well, I want to have you go. I mean, that's I mean, is it wrong that we're doing the... The voice? No, that's how it's sung. But like, you wouldn't do work by Rihanna without doing the ridiculous Jamaican why not? accent. Why not? I work, 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 work. I want to go to work, 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 work. Sure, that's not. Stop lyrics. stopping me from going to work, 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 work. work, work. God, I'm already late for work, work, work. work, work. work. Now I saw on YouTube some someone did a cover of it, and they did it like without doing the whole uh. kind of. Etc. Is it good? I think got a lot. It was it was quite well sung, I guess. But um, obviously they managed to find meaning in some of the words that I didn't quite understand. Uh, um, why were they crying? They just got completely slated because everyone's like, "Oh, you've taken the flavour out of it. Oh, you white bitch." I like mean, that. like Jesus. Yeah, no, that, it was pretty. That's hard. obviously yeah, up uh, well, to yeah, up to whatever people think. But like, yeah, I mean, that's a fairly good argument that you've taken the flavour out of it. Yeah. you could say you've made it their own, but I think. With the more diff with songs that have such strong flavour, you need to be really fucking confident in your version of it. Oh, it yeah. has equal or better. Flavor. Yeah, it's like taking a Johnny Cash song and then not doing uh like his accent or whatever. Like 
Bring a fire. Yeah, exactly. Like, imagine, bring a fire. Yeah, doing it in a Bristol accent, for example. Pretty burn, close. burn, burn. The ring of fire. <laughs> ring of fire. Yeah. Fucking burning. Jesus Christ, I eat hot wings. God, my fucking butthole. Fucking eat hot wings at lunch. Jesus Christ, it's burning my ring. I've got a ring sting. I've got a horrible ring sting. Who's having fun here? Fucking burning. I'm not. Fucking hell, this is hard. <laughs> Who's having fun here? Really Hands up hard. if you're having fun. Fucking hell, I can't do this. I think it's one of those ones where you have to put your back wheel on it, isn't it? Don't you hate it when people um, ask that question? What's that? Like, when you're doing something, and they're like, Who's having fun? <laughs> Are you having fun? Make sure you're Is having fun. fun. Check it off the list. Can someone, like... You it know. sounds like a SeaWorld tour guide. It also sounds like yeah, like a children's birthday party. Like I mean, when well, we, I said it. Give us an example, way. like as if. Let's yeah, get the fun rolling. Okay, in another way. Or do you, are you talking about like kind of when they do like, like the EA presentation? You're like, oh, we're having so much fun playing the new Division game or something. Well, no. Whatever, like, no, I'm not talking about that at all. Okay. I'm talking about anybody. Yeah. Just saying, whilst you're doing something that you otherwise were, you know, subconsciously enjoying. Now it's been. And then it's point. brought to your yeah, attention yeah. that you should be having fun, and you're trying to make sense of fun. And what yeah. fun no, is? This is this it's is like, fun. So you having fun? Uh, fun are my favorite favorite band. Fun are a fucking. <laughs> I hated that they had any kind of success. Some <laughs> that music was such trash. Oh god, poor old Aurelian was talking to me about music on Twitter once, and it, she brought up fun? fun, and she's really? like, "One of my favorite bands has got to be fun." I'm just like, "Oh, oh Jesus Christ!" Christ. For, for starters, no. who calls themselves fun? <laughs> fucking hell, fun. And the music didn't really reflect fun. Really? Like it, it reminded me of, like, uh, I, don't know, I think he's a really good singer. Like, his voice sure, is, I'm not is slang, really strong. Enough to sit, and, it's the, the song. But I know what you mean, sound, yeah. They write catchy music. They're kind of like a very shit American queen. Do you think so? Yeah. Because yeah. um, they go for that kind of, like, rousing, like, you know, invigorating music. But, yeah, it comes across as just kind of... I don't like it, all right? Yeah, yeah, yeah no, I agree. some sort of cool remix of I that agree. shit. I don't like it. I know what you mean. Don't call queen and invigorating music. I would. I call it eclectic. And well, eclectic means mul like with multiple um, yeah. facets. Because they do multiple styles, really. Yeah, but it can still be invigorating still and eclectic, isn't it? Well, it's all major key, isn't it? Is what you're suggesting. I'm saying that it, whenever I listen to their music, it makes me en feel energetic or energized. Mama but then just killed a man! <laughs> yeah. I feel great. <laughs> yeah, it's fucking... It, that's like vindicating. I mean, it's personal opinion. We don't need to, you know, have a distinct answer. I should have a distinct answer. Are you having fun? Huh? Try yeah, it. yeah, I am. Yeah, I love that track. Try, are you a big fan of Bruno Mars? Uh, yeah. You, you know he is. Why'd you ask that? <laughs> I like Bruno I just Mars. To make sure I just bring it up. Just say, Trot, how's your favourite artist Bruno well, Mars I doing? I don't know if it was your favourite. Is it your favourite? No. No. Who's your favourite artist, Trot? My basis from that is just about the one you had one song playing once when you were in your car. Yeah, that's, ages where, that's where it's all going from, yeah. I don't really have any other. He, he used to I play Grenade on really loop. Into. He had grenade I on loop. fucking hate grenade. He had grenade on loop. I hate grenade. Trot, did you? <laughs> you take I hate that album. Would you take I'd a like grenade? The one after that. I like the song that's like yeah 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 at the start. Da, da, da. Oh, sting. It sounds like yeah. It sounds blank, like sting. Blank uh, blank. Um. Was that Slim Shady? No. Blank blank blank. No, it wasn't Slim Shady. No. Ross's favorite. There's message in the bottom. It's so long since I wrote my note. Should we start a radio show where we sing all the songs? Local. We don't have licensing, so we don't. Yeah, we just do our own covers, like really. And we just have to guess, like, wait, and we're not allowed references. We literally have to be like, I think it goes like this. Okay, here's George Michael. That is, I think, George Michael, Careless Whisper. Careless Whisper. Well, that's, easy. that's one of our best ones, I think. Nail that one. But like, if we name a random one, like, um, well, Abba, we can go with Abba. Oh, I fucking Classic. hate Abba. Um, Mamma Mia is instant that's favorite. So I, oh, they, the Mia. composition of their songs is good, but I fucking hate the music so much. It's just so, it's just so trashy, isn't it? Well, it's. Thank it's you all, it's for all the, the music. It's all the time, isn't it? The song. It's literally we're like singing. It's like stage music, isn't it? Yeah. Thanks. It's like the end of yeah, yeah like a musical roll. The joy. That I guess brings. that's what makes them iconic, is because it's very kind of quite clean, poppy. Seven? Is it seventies? I think so. Yeah. Yeah. It's, it's of that era. It's. I thought it was pretty good. 
All right. I mean, I'm listening to it now. So You're a big biased. fan of it. Huge fan. Number one fan. Number one fan. Also, um, ABBA's number one ABBA. favorite band, ABBA. ABBA. Who's your favorite ABBA member? Bjorn. <laughs> that has to be Bjorn. Is Bjorn it's one of them? It's pronounced Bjorn, I think. But yeah. yeah, no, that's I knew that. Okay. What was it? What was the other, what were the other ones called? S- oh, he's number one fan, Smith. Olga. Olga. Was she actually one? <laughs> Fuck Helga. Those. Helga. Helga. Um, and that's Frederick. my limina- limitation of Swedish names. Mm-hmm. Yeah, they're Swedish. I mean, you got that bit right. Yeah. <laughs> Is it Swedish? Is it? Swedish names? I think they're Swedish. Danish? Danish? Norwegian? What, Finnish? What, what, Fuck it, throw the Finns in there. Didn't Buck Fizz come out? Um, it was, uh, was that a spin off band? This, well, not from them, but they were around mm. the same time uh, with the Eurovision drink. stuff. Um, I, I, I one do their love songs, it, Fizz, uh, like. Gotta keep it up. I can't remember how it fucking goes. <laughs> Ross, are you <laughs> secretly harboring a knowledge of really bad 70s music? Pretty much, yeah. Right. Did you know Abba? Uh, came up with the original IKEA theme tune. Did they? Nope, that's a lie. <laughs> oh, right. That's what is the IKEA lie. theme tune? <laughs> I should remember that. Can because, you pinpoint like, the IKEA? There is no IKEA. IKEA. Yeah, IKEA. 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 Um, you should definitely hold that as a like a useless fact, like because you know there's games, there's, there's board games where you have to like trick people into what was that game we were playing online, the Jackbot jukebox thing. Oh, oh yeah. yeah. There was definitely a mo- like mode in that where you had to well, make a believable fact. Die, aren't they? Yeah, well, you know, Trop. It's not like hundreds of thousands of people are watching this. That's true. No, he's, he's right. This is probably the least watched uh, oh, next to Worm. That's hurtful. <laughs> <laughs> it's only like 90,000 fifths. Yeah. Well, over boo. time, you know. Can't say hundreds. I'm talking about those grandfathered views. True. Grandfathered views. All those people watching us right now, they're going to come back when they're old age pensioners. Oh, yeah. comment if you're We're watching long this in 2020. Dead. We're long dead. We are long dead. Or a neuron interface. Yeah, you're looking really looking forward, forward, to, forward that. to that neuron interface. Yeah, Chris Trot just doesn't want to interface with his eyes anymore. He got him lasered, but that wasn't enough. Yeah, I want to have interface n- with his mind. electronic eyes. Technically, all, all, all body parts are electronic. Oh, Thanks, Trot. Fucking hell. Organic matter. Still has to send electrical signals. I'm trying to spray you with organic matter in a minute. Ooh. That sounds pretty fucking sexy. <laughs> Is it Let's brine? get that happening. It's brine. Yeah. From my. Oh, it's pure brine. Tuna can toad. Ah! Ah, the tuna can Stings. toad, no! Stings a lot. Oh, this is a really weird bit where the. Thanks for all the joy you're bringing! <laughs> Who can live without it? <laughs> I ask in all honesty. Because what cause would life be? The thing is, Abba also reminds me of other shitty things, like mainly like Top of the Pops. Remember Top, Top of the Pops 2? Oh, yeah. Yeah. Like, like, when you were born. Abba would be on it. there, but also fucking Slade. Would be on there. I hate Slade. It's like, Christmas. yeah, and, and, and oh, I fucking hate Christmas. And then music it ba- so then it much. fucking backflips me to you know, like a, a time boobs. Um, when I Boobly. had boobs. Well, I hate boobs. Well, boobs is. I'm a fun. very. I've, I've said hate a lot, but I can't stand boobs either. Really? Oh, he sounds so disingenuous when he sings. Well, he's just very cheesy, isn't he? Yeah, yeah, he is. Well, he's a good but singer. That though. works for. But yeah, he does well. But everyone, like, everyone puts on a voice when you sing. You put on a voice. Yeah, when you I sing. know, but I'm not claiming to be, you know, a multi-million selling well, guy. Is. So the he spotlight's is. on him. He's, but why is he? That's not that because people ingenuous. don't listen to his voice and realise there's no feeling in how he sings. Well, you it's don't know just that. Christmas is well, it? in my opinion, I think that. I'm not saying that nothing. But you're I'm saying suggesting is that, that everyone else does. He's got the wool pulled over their eyes. Fair enough. I yeah. shouldn't think that. I'm saying that my opinion is that I don't Correct. like him because he doesn't sound disingenuous. He sounds disingenuous. There you go. Fair enough. Thanks for the clarification. That's okay. Um, oh, I control the disconnect. Oh, that's back. Doesn't matter, cause uh, be a fuck Slade, man. Oh. Slade suck <laughs> dick. I don't like the idea of Christmas music in general. Like, it's Christmas. I don't understand why we have to listen to blame, specific blame, music blame, constantly at Christmas. Blame, blame, and yeah, it's all got fucking like motifs, like bells and it. It's just like it's because they all want all that Christmas money. Whoever started that. That is all I need. We have to we have to come up with a Christmas song now, like an official one, other than Pleasure Elf, which is an like kind of a Christmas. It's an anthem. I was speaking to my friend in Sweden the other night, and he said that next door, some people were having a party. Now, as in, like I was online on TS, right? And the people next door to him were having a really noisy party, and then suddenly Pleasure Elf came on. (laughs) 
Really? Next door. I was like, what? He's like, yeah. I think they're playing Pleasure Elf. Oh, party like, song, is it? I, well, I, I think it is, guys. Oh, shit. 24-7 guys. party, isn't it? Was it was such a short song. It's kind of like a Coke party <laughs> song. Yeah, loop dot. Yeah. Coke party song. Coke party. I think something a little bit more... Pleasure Elf again! A bit more goey than that, mate. Maybe a speed party song. <laughs> if you put it on really, loop, yeah, you're laughing. I'm really sorry for the game grumps. Actually, no, it's their own fault. You know they, what? They it's their own fault. They, they decided to keep playing it until they got enough donations to stop it. <laughs> oh, wait. Just fucking... use it as torture music. That, is, that could be torture music. It's a great yeah. idea, though. Well, Tanner Bay that. are now using uh, a popular song for a bad film called Pleasure Elf. We're going to use the brown to sound their... and keep playing it until you guys donate enough to stop shitting yourself. <laughs> the brown sound. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> You love the brown sound. I do. It's an inc interesting concept, which I don't believe in, but I love the idea it's, it's of it. It's not really been proven, has it? Well, there's some funny What's videos about it, but yeah, you're okay. right. Okay. I can't, I can't base facts on funny videos. Guys, that drop. was Brentwood Flow. Ooh, that's a nice one. <laughs> and guess what? And guess what? You've got a Brentwood Flow. Ooh, you've got a nice Brentwood Flow, mate. I won. Ah, wow, 12 points. Nice. Oh, nice. <laughs> Brilliant. Great job. <laughs> Thanks for joining us for Trials. Thank you. That wasn't an ex-Supercross track. Why does it say ex-Supercross on the top? Oh, Fucking yeah. That's Thank good. you, everybody, nice. for joining us. Remember, if you've got a tuna can chode, subscribe. Subscribe. <laughs> Bye.